Hello there, I'm back with another book review and book recommendation and this one is called The Innocent Wife by Amy Lloyd. Um, this book uh, is her debut novel. Um, she won the Daily, the Daily Mail bestseller competition. Apparently she won £20,000 for this book. Um, and it's, it's it starts off very interesting um, about a girl who is writing letters to a guy that's in prison. And not only is he in prison, but he's on death row. Um, and she has watched a documentary about him. Uh, a girl called Carrie has done this documentary where they're trying to prove his innocence, Dennis's innocence. Um, and so um, our main character gets quite obsessed with him and starts writing these letters. And it's it seems to move very fast at the start. Um, at the start, I was kind of thinking to myself, goodness, you know, uh, she could really pan this out and make a lot more of these letters and a lot more of um, them falling in love because they do fall in love. They're writing to each other and they fall in love. And um, she decides to go out and visit him in prison. Um, and that all went really quickly and I kind of thought why is this going so quickly she could make so much more of this but then I kind of understood why later on um, so she goes out to see him and um, and I suppose I don't want to say too much about what happens next but basically he, do, he does get um, he does get out of prison he's, he's pro proven to be innocent and so then it follows their um, relationship and what happens when he gets out and how he deals with the press and the attention and the fame and um, and I think what I liked a lot about this book is the way that the author um, described the main character um, she depicted her really well because the character is very timid, very insecure, um, really low self-esteem, thinks that she's ugly, thinks that she's um, not worthy of his love, um, is very jealous, um, very jealous of any girl that he's talking to. And just the way that <clears throat> the way that the author describes um her mannerisms and the things that she says and oh no oh no you choose and things it would just it was just so spot on the way somebody like that would get on so I thought that was very clever um I also thought it was very clever the way he, um she depicted his um his character um he was quite grumpy quite abrupt quite brusque um and uh, as you would imagine somebody in prison to be you know um and th it was interesting the kind of prison visit and him coming out with the chains around his ankles i kind of felt like wow that was interesting how she managed to kind of depict that life H either she has researched it very well or she's or she's visited somebody in prison at some stage because it was amazing the detail that she went into um then there was a conflict from um, other people who who still believed that he that he wasn't innocent that he that he was guilty for his crime and so the way that they were reacting to her you know being really snide and saying oh if you've got a thing for child killers and stuff um so it was quite a complex book and had a lot in it um and the tension just got progressively more as the book went along so that was well worth a read as well so nice short and sweet one from me today and that is me over and out thank you